What's good, guys? If you want cheap, fast, reliable MT, make sure to hit up my sponsor, SafeNBAMT.com. Use code BUGS for 5% off at checkout and stop getting scammed by NBA 2K's pack odds. Hit them up right now. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Bugs back on another NBA 2K2 on my team video. And guys, today, word on the street is that they just released some new super packs. So, here we go. We got the rewind packs. And guys, these are actually poppable with MT. Um, so, honestly, I see Giannis in there, which kind of makes me upset. But yo, uh, we're going to pop them with MT. We're going to hope for the best, man. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure to sub it up. Comment down below. That would be appreciated, man. We got super packs with MT, and this is pretty much what it's going to guarantee most of the time. Sapphires and emeralds at this stage of the game. That's just how it goes. Also, man, sub it up, comment down below. Listen, guys, another announcement. My old Twitter, at your bugs, is hacked. It is not me. I am not scamming anybody that is my old account. As you can see on that account, all the vouchers on that account are from months ago. If you look at my new account down in the description on Twitter, that is my real account. I want to make that clear. This Yo Bugs guy is not me. I got hacked months ago, and it's getting blown up on Twitter that I'm a, ha I'm a scammer. Why would I ever scam anybody? I never scammed anybody in my life. And if you're that stupid to think that is me, when I'm literally blocked by my old account on Twitter, you are insane. Put me on a lie detector test. That is not me. As you can also see, the way the guy texts, it's clearly not me. Because I text like a complete idiot. This guy's like actually like trying too hard. I don't try. I'm just easygoing. But uh, yeah, yo bugs is not me. Go block that account on Twitter. That old account has like 1,800 followers. It used to have like 2,100. The vouchers are old. If you look at my new account, the vouchers are newer. They're this month. You know what I'm saying? So I don't know. You could you could believe whatever, but just know that is not me. Just want to make that clear. And yes, if you do need MT, hit me up on the Twitter and Instagram down below in the description, not the old Twitter. But yo, let's get into it, man. Let's go. Okay. So enough of the, ra the rage quitting, whatever. We're going to get into this video. Like it up, sub it up, comment, all that good stuff, and let's get into this. So first off, I see Giannis in the packs, which is very interesting, all right? We're going to see Giannis go to a buyout probably today. Um, does it suck? It does. Honestly, this is another thing I've been thinking about. So they have Giannis in packs, which means they're probably going to drop Giannis in a freaking... He might come out this week. And they also have... Uh, is this a Deke Bay new or my buggy? I don't recall having a Sadiq Bay. I just don't. When did the Sadiq Bay come out? Like, seriously, I don't remember him. So, we might have new car. Uh, maybe he did come out. I don't even remember. But anyway, Sadiq Bay, I, I like that card. Um, so, we got Ben Simmons now. Are these cards going to drop? Honestly, all the cards in the set, the only one that I could say that rings a bell. This Edwards is new too, right? Am I bugging? I don't remember a Dark Matter Edwards. And as you guys know, Dark Matt Edwards was insane last year. So hold up. Let's check this tweet out because I don't recall any of these cards. All right. Okay. Yes. Yeah, so Dark Matter Edwards, Galaxy Sadiq, Pink Diamond Hayes, and Diamond McDaniels. That makes sense now. Okay. Um, so I'm guessing Diamond McDaniels is going to be a bunch of ballers. So now what should you be sniping? Well, let's go over to Mr. Dark Matter Filter and let's check this out. So we got the Dark Matter Bosch, and I'm guessing John Morant at a very cheap price. So now what you're going to see is, you're going to see John Morant drop in value like crazy today. You're going to see John Morant go from 100K very, 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 very quickly all the way down to, I don't know, whatever K. So that's what's going to happen. Um, John Morant is going to be the next viable Opal, and that's exactly why they did release him in these packs. So that kind of does suck, but this Edwards is very, very, very promising. Let's look over Mr. Edwards, Anthony Edwards, Dark Matter, and he's not even up on the auction. So whoever does pull that Edwards is going to make a good amount of money. Um, but guys, right now, what should you be doing? Honestly, these super packs are okay. They're nothing crazy, guys. They're nothing insane. You're definitely going to see a little bit of a market crash. So I'm honestly going to tell you in this video what cards I would be picking up and what cards you should be picking up. All right. I don't know why Dark Matter Zion won't pop up on the freaking screen. There we go. So Dark Matter Zion is still cheap. He's probably going to drop in value. And I don't think both um, both Zions are on here. Only the regular ones. So it's pretty interesting. Um, so here we go. So players you should pick up or keep an eye on. Definitely Lonzo. Uh, keep your eyes on Barrett. Keep your eyes on Booker. All right. Luca. Keep your eyes on him. Uh, keep your eyes on this Carl Anthony Towns. He's a bunch of beast. This sex thing is everybody loves Sexton. Keep your eyes on Przingis. And keep your eyes on Bull Bull. Keep your eyes on Mo Bamba, LaMelo Ball, Bam's kind of old, 
Tyrese is a very good card. Keep your eyes on him to invest in that is. So maybe even McDaniels gets a bunch of ballers. So honestly, I think out of all these cards, I will be most definitely looking at Mo Bamba the most because he's so athletic at center and he's also been playing very well in the NBA. So this is probably going to be my best investment out of all of them. It's going to be the cheapest, probably the cheapest investment as well. And because since he's a low tier, he's going to be popping up like nothing. So let's put my filter to 5,200. And honestly, I would only buy this card for under 4,800-ish, I would say. So uh, yeah, Mo Bamba under around 4,800-ish, guys. Um, so yeah, under 4,800-ish, that's what I would say. Honestly, yeah. Uh, Mo Bamba is definitely going to be a card that does shoot up in value, I would say. But you have to get him for a very good price. Okay, so pay attention to Mo Abba. Pay attention to Tyrese. I'm a huge Tyrese guy. I think he's an amazing rookie. I think he's an amazing player. I think his jump shot's money. I think his dribble moves are money. I just think he deserves to be a starter in the NBA in his rookie season. Um, he does get a pretty good amount of minutes. But guys, this guy Tyrese, he's the real deal, man. People, I'm telling you, man. I know the Kings are out of playoffs. But this guy next year is going to ball out. Don't sleep on my man. Next up, we got LaMelo Ball. Who doesn't know LaMelo Ball? Even though he probably is going to get an insane card next week. Um, just try to buy as many Lamellos as you can. Try to literally just run the market, the diamond market. Once again, these sewer packs did come out, so they're not like just came out. So you're not gonna see so many snipes. This card right here, though, at 7,900 isn't a bad price. You probably get him cheaper. You could probably sell that for like 9k, make a little bit of MT, nothing crazy. But keep your eyes on him. And honestly, dark matter filter, guys. Since there is some buyable cards, you might see a lot more buyouts. You're gonna see a lot more snipes. It's just the only problem is I would say it's going to be on the Western end. Now, um, on the Dark Matter Western end, we got Ray Allen. We got Chava Rand, so that's going to get ruined as well. We also have Magic Johnson. We have Blake Griffin. We have LeBron James. We have Curry. So, Western, Kevin Garnett, KPJ, who's also in packs. He's going to drop. Sean Kemp. I don't really care about AD. Uh, Wilt Chamberlain, Gary Payton, and uh, yeah, and Westbrook. So, I guess the Dark Matter Western filter is cool until John Morant does become a buyout, which will happen today. But anyways, guys, that's really all we got for the video. Um, honestly, I want to pop one more pack, but I'm not going to. So, uh, yeah, that's all we got. <sighs> Hope you guys enjoyed, man. Stay tuned for more content. I'm going to throw up this RJ Barrett on the auction, get my 100K back. And, yeah, that's all we got, man. Hope you guys enjoyed. Have a good one. Peace.